So education, a college education, is meant to be transformative. But what does that really mean? A genuine transformation changes the way you look at the world. It changes your values and your concerns. And college can certainly do that. But the way it does it is different for different students. For some of you, coming to college is a culmination of a trajectory you've been in since you were small. And though being here is exciting, it might not be that different or unexpected from what you envisioned college would be. Maybe your parents told you about their own college experience and you can compare notes. Maybe your friends, are, your friends from home are also at college in various places in the United States and you can share with them the experience that you're having. But for other students, often low income and first generation students, college is a radical break from the experience they've been having. Coming to college involves a large departure from what they're used to. It might be difficult to share their experience of college with their family and their friends back home. For some, coming to Penn, even if they're from the city of Philadelphia, might feel very far from home. And they have to live with the knowledge that they might not ever go back home in some sense after they leave here. So for those students, transformation is really quite radical. So college can be transformative, but how transformative it is actually can depend on your socioeconomic class. But we rarely tell students this, and I believe that we should. Is this kind of transformation unjust, this unjust difference in transformation? Well, to find that out, you're going to have to read my book. <laughs> Thanks.